Welcome back, my last epoch friends, family, relatives, neighbors, all that kind of stuff. How do I grind for my XP? Some of you might have noticed, like yesterday, I was like level dirt. And then today, I'm a little bit higher level. Well, here's the thing. Go and visit your monoliths. Some people who've been playing this game for like 100 years already know about this stuff. But for the rest of it, go to a monolith and just grind these things out. Not only are you going to get XP, you're going to get other rewards. Take a look at this. Let me show you how this works. Okay, so for this one, it's going to drop runes. Okay, so this is nice. You get some item rarity, some XP gain. That's kind of nice. You can go after this one if you want that kind of stuff. You can go after this one if you want to get a bunch of shards. Okay, so let's go after some runes here, people. Now, there's another part of this that makes it a little bit special. Oh, yeah, it makes it special. Because after you fill this bar up, you, you know, you get higher in this bar, you unlock. Yeah, you unlock your little quest echoes. You could do those as well. And then raise those up. So once you unlock this one, then the next one will be unlocked if you have already done 160 stability worth of the other echoes, right? What's my number at the top? You see that 184, right? I'm going to have to do a few more before I go to this echo. So let's get that knocked out first so we can do these three in a row, just bam, bam, bam. That will be kind of nice. And this tells you at the top how much points you're going to get for them. You see it right there. Timeline stability 17 up to 36 bonus by doing this. Okay, where's the bonus though? I know a lot of us are new here. There are some people who've been playing this for like 100 years and they know all that stuff. Well, slay these enemies. You're going to lure out an ambush. And then you get to kill an additional number of enemies. Whoa! I, what, maybe I should pay attention to what's going on. I was getting tore up. I just literally stood there in the fire. You know what I like to do? I like to open the mini-map so you can actually see what's going on. Now, okay, what is this? Like this fire stuff. Enemies have a 50% cooldown. Enemies have dodge. Yeah, but when I walk out there and you're throwing fire on me, buddy, that's not nice, okay? I'm just trying to have a decent conversation, and you're around here throwing fire on people. That's not how... They don't teach you that in school, throwing fire on people. All right, now this thing is after me. That one's after me, too. Let's go after this one first. Because he's, oh my god, look at that. Look, where's my, get behind this guy. And yeah, do that. Now, don't worry about those colors. I colored things so I know what I'm interested in, okay? So I got like green capital letters for the things that have the stats I want. Because I don't want to just sort through like millions of things, trying to figure out what's good and what's bad. So, oh my, I don't have my hammers ready. I don't have hammers. I was talking to you guys. See what you guys did to me? I don't have my hammers ready. I just went up there with the... Oh, oh, wow. Wow. They So, whoa. They are teaching me a lesson, aren't they? This is not a good lesson to learn. All right, so let's just go through this. All right, now here's the thing. When you get to these... Sealed and temporarily displaced for dangerous arcane experiments. What should you do about those? I recommend to clear first. Clear out this little stuff that's going to get in your way. So while you're fighting the big dogs, these little monkeys are going to come up there and disturb you, right? All right, so now I go up to the big dog, right? You got to click it for it to open. It doesn't matter. And I'm just going to prepare myself. Just get a bunch of hammers going out around there. Get your little health ready. Just pre-cast a couple times. I can cast all I want. You know why? Look at my, my, what? My mana cost is 11? No, it's not. This one. Zero. Okay. I was looking at the completely wrong thing. Mana cost is zero for healing. So I could just spam healing all day. But instead, I'm just going to spam hammers. And now, once we get enough of those up, Click that, open it, and then take them down really quick. Let's see if it works. You ready? Okay, sigil. Open it. Take him down really quick. Go. He's not going down. Okay, can you please go down quicker? Can you please go down? Like, there we go. Yeah, exactly like we planned it, guys. So you just open it, and bam, he's like gone right in his face. So, yeah, so you could run around and get kited by him if you want. I, I'm not even getting kited. 
by this little guy. So one thing I do is I like to rush things like this one. The ones that spray, the ones that have like a ranged attack, you just got to rush up to them so your hammers will take care of them. Throw some heal out there for your buddy every once in a while. Like this. Look at that. Don't let that get to you. Oh, my God. This one's getting to me because my rush was on cooldown or was it not? I don't know. Let's just pretend it was on cooldown. My bonus stability, I, I mentioned that before, by clearing a certain amount of mobs, you're just raising your stability by that much. It, it said it will give you extra 36 stability. Keep clearing mobs. Get that. What? What the? Yeah, I saw the attack, but I didn't see where it was coming from. I just saw, like, fire shooting from everywhere, okay? So, yeah, don't blame me for not knowing where it came from. You see fire, you rush it, and you just take him out. The echo's over, but we don't leave yet. Why? Because look at my bonus. I only have half the bonus unlocked. You have to clear more money. It says it right there. The bonus is gained from slaying enemies. So let's go through and slay a few more. Got some hammers. Just, just run out there. Let the hammers take care of those. And I pretty much only go until the bonus is done. But, oh, that's no, no. Yeah. What if I had died there? Oh, my God. That's like the worst. That's the worst. Yeah. And that's why I only go until the bonus is done. Because then you start getting sleepy and you, like, forget something and, bam, you're gone. Boo-hoo. All of your time. Down the drain. Down the drain. So let's not let that happen. Look at these eyeballs just like blowing this fire out there. Got to take care of that. But you got to heal your minion up first as well. Heal, heal that guy. I'm at 23 of 36. So let's get some of the more of these packs taken care of. So we got 24 now. Okay. There we go. This fire is trying to make short work of me. Let's teach him a story. Teach him a lesson. How do we teach a story? Okay, here's a story. Once upon a time, let's teach this. Okay, we got 26 out of 36. Okay, so now let's just go ahead and finish and clear this thing out. Now remember, you can leave right now. It's done. But that bonus stability will unlock those additional, yeah, those additional storylines, those additional echoes. That's what I'm trying to unlock. So we can actually get those done. We could just manually grind them one by one. But why not take the bonus? You're getting like double the credits for it. Might as well. So that's half of the echoes you have to actually go through to get to the big stuff faster. That's what it's all about. Getting to the big stuff as fast as you can. Oh, my God. I'm standing in the little fire. Yeah, you saw what I did. I just started immediately spamming my zero cost heal with the dot on it. Yeah, I got a heal with a, not a damage over time. I got a heal over time. It got a hot heal over time. H-O-T. Don't want to dot yourself up, even though you can cast it as an offensive. Whoa, look at that. That was just getting blowed all over. Okay, let's get in there and help our buddy. Oh, no, no, no. I'm standing in the acid. Did I actually pick up that garbage? While I was trying to talk to him. Okay, now here's the thing. We're 36 of 36. We can go back now. We've got done everything we want. You could keep going through it. You see anything of importance. So look at that. Let's get our runes. And now, after we get this treasure, first thing we do is let's take a look. Let's take a look first to see what we've done. Look at this. We're at 237 stability. And look, I only need three more stability. So if, if there were like three more bonuses I could have done, we would have been so finished with that. But you guys get the idea now. It's very good to get those bonus. Yeah, get them up to 24 bonus stability. Get that out of the way so you can actually unlock these faster. And then go through those quest echoes, guys. That's a nice way to get some XP. You see my XP where it was before? Bam, it just shot up there. So I'm going to go ahead and continue. You guys, hit subscribe. I'm going to be bringing you more. This is kind of fun, okay? We're going to be doing this together, me and my hammered in. Talk to you soon. Savetia signing out.